How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Uh, now here for the London Film Festival, uh, what films are you particularly interested in seeing at the festival this year? I'm very interested in seeing Suffragette. Um, I, I'm really looking forward to that film because I have sort of dealt with the whole suffragette movement in a way in other stuff I've done and I'm really keen to see how they've handled it in this and also uh, you know I'm a fan of Kerry Mulligan so uh, that's probably the one I would select but I think they've got a pretty good uh, list actually. I think it's a strong British list as well this year. Yeah I think so don't you? I do yeah. Uh, um, uh, what challenges do you think they would have faced with suffragette? What are the particular challenges of making that story? I think there's always a sense in any society that the way it is is the way it has to be. And revolutionaries with vision, I don't mean sort of shouting in the streets, but revolutionaries with vision can see it doesn't have to be that way. And they are prepared to fight a seeming brick wall until it changes because they had an accurate vision of the future and not simply a fantastic one. And I, I think that's what those women understood, that, that having no vote was already out of date when they started the movement mm -hmm. uh, and it was no longer acceptable. And you think even, you know, the Liberal Prime Minister, Asquith, were terribly against it. I mean, uh, it was a very, very tough fight. By the end of the First War, then things had changed and it had started to seem inevitable. But it wasn't inevitable at the turn of the century and they were having to fight their way uphill. Women of all sorts, all classes, all types, all ages, up and down the country. You know, again, one shouldn't forget that. It wasn't simply this little knot in London who were doing it all. There were women everywhere, and there were men too involved in the cause. But at the beginning of those things, it's as if it can't be changed. Even if it's regrettable, that's the way it has to be. And they're the ones who see that it doesn't. Do you think there's anything particularly timely about the release of it as well, coming out now? Well, I think, you know, women's rights, women in history, women's contribution. I mean, we're all kind of exploring all that all the time at the moment. Putting women back into history, actually, in many cases where there has been a key woman in some sociological or historical development and she gets sort of left out of the, the telling of it in the history books. And our generation uh, is putting them back. And I think that's a good thing. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching... Hey, you guys! Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.